Hey fam, it's another makeover day and I'm so excited. I know you guys love these type of videos and I do too. So let's just get straight into it today. We're making over the living room. Well, to be honest, it's not a big makeover. It's a little makeover, but it's still a makeover. We're going to change up some things, switch up some things and we'll see what it looks like at the end of it. So this is what the living room looks like before and again this is my mother-in-law's living room and i'm always so happy to do anything that she wants to be done in the house and this is what it looks like before and now let's get into it so the main change that we're making today is to change the rug she has a beautiful rug right now in the living room but it's a new year so we need some new things you know jazz it up a little bit change it out a little bit make it a little bit different you know new year new things new vibes that's what we're talking about so we got a new rug and we need to go and unbox it and put it out and we're hoping that it looks exactly like what it looks like online on the photo you know when you choose things online sometimes it comes looking different so fingers crossed that it actually come looking even better than what the photo looked like online. It's a really big rug and it's really heavy. It's from a company called Rugs USA, but let's go check it out and then we'll talk a little bit more about it, yeah? Uh, yeah. Hey. I'm a Only if you're ready, 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 ready. Let's go. I'm only looking for loyalty, all I need from you I'm thinking you be the one for me, I can see it on you Your love they do me every time, with you by my side we gon' shine Baby girl you know you royalty, I've been waiting for you Me no care about all the noise but I'm digging your station See how you got my head spinning with a body rotation Body rotation. Couple days went by now, I'm losing my patience. Go ahead, drop a pin, girl. Wanna know your location? What's your location? Had to pull a plug on your ex, now you coming my way. Uh. I can switch it up for you, girl. I'm no longer a player. No longer a player. See that pretty face on my screen, that'll make my day. Uh. Hey, only looking for loyalty, all I need from you I'm thinking you be the one for me, I can see it on you Your love they do me every time, with you by my side we gon' shine Baby girl you know you royalty, I've been waiting for you So now that we removed the rug that was in the living room and we clean up the area, now it's time to put down the rug pad and then the actual rug. And I'm so excited. And like I mentioned, this rug is from a company called Rugs USA. I can leave the link in the description bar for you guys if you're interested in a rug like this. The rug's size is 10 inches by 13 inches, which should do what we needed to do in here. So let's get started. So we just lay out the rug pad and with the rug pad it looks very big right now. I think it's bigger than the 11. The actual rug which is 11 by 13. Yeah so the actual rug should be 11 by 13 but 
laying out this pad um, which should be discreet and um, hidden under the rug it looks bigger than the rug or it looks bigger than 11 by 13 so we're going to measure it right now to make sure that they actually send the size or a size smaller than the rug so it can just fit exactly with the rug or smaller um let's go see yeah. So this is basically 12 feet across. So already. So maybe at the 13, this is supposed to be kind of smaller than Maybe that should be that's a 13, right? Maybe. Because remember but it's 10 way, by so 13, but I guess if this is 12, then over here should be around 9. But, but this, this looks, looks way a lot longer than this side. Longer than that side. So we don't know, but let's see. Hold on, let me show this now. Hold on. Yeah. This is definitely longer than we need to, so we're gonna have to cut it. Correction. I just went to check the rug, and it's actually not a 10 by 13. It's actually an 8 foot 10 by 13. So it's even smaller than the rug part that came with it. So we have a lot of cutting to do. So guys, look how Sean catch up the coach on the ceiling. The ceiling. <laughs> like we needed to move so that we can finish cutting out. We're cutting over there, but you know I'm kind of brace it in the ceiling, and I hope that it doesn't fall. So we need to move quickly because the ceiling not that high as you can see, and it's just bracing on it. Well, what I was trying, what I was trying to do was get this to stand up but the ceiling wasn't tall enough for us to do that so up and trying to do that i figure um yeah just catch it up just catch it up and see if it will stay and that just work for now so we'll see we'll see so far what we've done is to cut a piece of the rug pad because again the dimension of the rug is eight feet 8 feet 10 inches by 13 so we just cut 12 to fall just under the 13 piece and now we're gonna cut 8 to fall under the 8 by 10 piece you know what I mean so let's keep watching damn yeah this this is huge sometimes things don't come exactly how you plan it Sometimes it don't work out exactly what you have in mind and you just have to get creative and get it done. And that's what we're trying to do. Get creative and get it done.
It feels so soft. Oh, it feels so good. And it looks good. It looks like the photo that we saw online. We wanted to get some blue because as you can see, a lot of the decor inside the living room is blue. So we want some accent blue and I think it's perfect. Because of the lighter color, and then it has the blue to contrast, a little bit of brown that goes with the decor that's already inside. I'm so happy with how it's turning out. Comment below and let me know what you guys think about the rug. And remember, I'll leave the link to it in the description bar in case you guys want to get one for yourself. But it's really nice, it's really soft. I can tell it's really good quality, so I'm happy about Ooh. that. And I'm happy, you know, after long hard work, it's finally done. And it makes the place just look so good. Love it. So now to put back the the furniture that we moved, <laughs> all the different decor that we moved, and put the, the finishing touches. Uh, yeah, let's do that. is all laid and I'm so happy with how it turned out let me know what you guys think in the comment section below how did we do how was what, what do you think of our rug selection and yeah again the link is in the description bar so you can always check it out but the video is not done yet we still have more to go so keep watching so it's the next day and it's time for me to start removing these extensions from my hair it's gonna be a long journey, I can already tell, but I think it has done its time. I put them in from December and we're now in February. So I think it has definitely outgrown or overstayed its welcome. Look, I have a lot of new growth. I don't even know if you guys can see it. A lot of new growth. So, time to get it out. The easiest way to go about this is to cut it short and then try to unravel it. So that's exactly what I'm about to do. Thing is, I don't want to cut my hair because my hair is also pretty long. And to figure out where exactly on it. But I think that the lady that did my hair, she, I think she did a really good job at it. It was very neat, especially in the beginning when it, you know, was nice and fresh. 
thing she really did her thing. It took me a while to find someone to actually do my hair. And I'm happy that I was so happy when I found her and I'm happy at the results. I was happy with the results when I was done. I was like, yeah, she need probably go back to her and have her redo it because it wasn't that good. You know, like when I do your hair, the hair come out good and it feel good. When it, when it look good, you feel good. You know what I mean? And it feel good, then you feel more confident. Happy about that. By the way, I want to apologize for not posting a video last Sunday. Um, I know a lot of you were expecting me to post, but I was busy working on castor oil stuff so I didn't get to post on Sunday but I see that a lot of you understood because I did put out a post to say I'm not posting and some of you were like all right we get it plus as you know during this time a whole lot is happening so there are probably gonna be some times I don't get to post but I'm trying my hardest to post at least once a week which is on a Sunday and I'm trying to post anywhere between 4 and 6 p.m. but really really trying for four so you can always look out for a video on sunday and if i'm not going to post i'll write it in the community section so you'll see that information if something happened and i'm not posting that day but definitely on a sunday and then i'll always try for a bonus in the week but definitely on a sunday this video that you're watching right now is a bonus video especially because i didn't post last week sunday so i'm gonna post this in the week so it should be posted on a thursday which today is a thursday i'm gonna post it today so here's your bonus also i wanted to tell you guys that castor oil is finally ready a few weeks back i had announced that i am going to be selling castor oil jamaican black castor oil that is and a lot of you expressed interest i had explained to you that the castor oil the jamaican black castor oil is what i have used in my hair for years because a lot of people over the years that i've had my channel has always been asking what is it that i put in my hair what do i use to grow my hair how do i take care of the hair and whatnot and i try to give tidbits of information here and there but one thing that has always remained consistent is castor oil. I live by it. Jamaican black castor oil. And I mean the authentic one from Jamaica. From the farmers in Jamaica. From the beans in Jamaica. That's made in Jamaica. Without any salt or preservatives or parabens or any of those things. The pure authentic one is the one that I've always used in my hair. And continue to and especially now throughout pregnancy where you know so many things happening with our bodies and hormones and all of that the castor oil is still the thing that is consistent that has been helping me and so I really live by it and because so many of you have asked about it I'm happy to offer it for you sourced in Jamaica by Jamaicans local farmers the Jamaican black castor oil and I've been working on it now for a while to get it to you and it is finally finally ready so it's gonna be launched this Sunday which is Sunday February 4th 2024 that's when the website will go live so you guys can check it out and it's gonna go live at exactly 4 p.m. Sunday 4th 2024 so look out for that I will leave the link in the description bar for you to check it out. I'll post on Sunday again so you can be reminded. However, when I first announced about the castor oil, a lot of you were interested. And I told you to put your contact information, which includes your email address, on a form so that I can know if it makes sense or not to proceed with it. And can offer you first dips so that you get access to it before anyone else and a lot of you had left your email addresses so thank you i'm actually very impressed and happy that to see a lot of you wanting to take your hair and skin journey serious by getting the castor oil so a lot of people had already submitted their email addresses and i have all of those any of you that are watching right now and you wish to also put your name on that list you can because here's what's gonna happen i'm going to send out an email 
to those people that have submitted their emails early so I'm gonna send that out on Saturday and you guys will have first access to the website to go on to get your Jamaican black castor oil before the rest of the world gets access to it so you get it so I'm going to send an email remember we're launching on Sunday but I'm gonna send an email on Saturday to everyone who submitted their email addresses so that you guys can go on the website and purchase before it opens up to everyone before it's sold out. The website is currently closed because the launch date is on Sunday but I'll send you guys a temporary password so that you can put it in the website go on and shop as normal and get your hands on your Jamaican black castor oil before anybody else does. So if you want to be a part of that you have between now and Saturday which today is Thursday, so you need to put it ASAP on the list which is in the description bar below. Click the first link in the description bar below. Put your email address on it, your contact details on it, and you'll be added to the list to get early access to the Jamaican Black Castor Oil. And there's a lot of people, so you want to move quickly before it's sold out. Alright? And then after Saturday, Sunday, the website opens up and you can always go back and go get yours in case you missed Saturday. But I'm excited. I'm excited for you guys to get access to what I've been using for so many years. What has helped me for so many years. I've seen a lot of black castor oil, supposedly black castor oil in the stores here and just looking at it looking at the what it looks like the color the smell all of that i can tell that's not the real thing and it's just unfortunate that grand jamaica is being used to promote things that are not of jamaica from jamaica or by jamaicans so i don't want to do that I'm getting the real authentic thing and making you guys get access to it I actually went ahead and I purchased one of the black cast oils from a local hair store when I first migrated to the US because I had run out of my bottle and I figured okay they're marketing Jamaican black cast oil hoping that it's the same thing and I want to tell you it's been two years and the bottle is still full in the cupboard where I keep my hair stuff because once I got it and I tried to pour it in my hand, the consistency is not the same as I'm used to from Jamaica. A lot more watery, it's a lot more pale in color, it don't have the castor smell. The castor smell is unique to the castor oil because of the roasting process that the castor beans go through and the ash content that is in the castor oil from the roasting and the boiling and the clarification and all of that the whole process of making the castor oil that is missing from the one that I bought here and the ones that I see here I don't know if anything else is added some of them are see on the shelf things are added to it and I don't like none added to my thing so the bottle's still full can't use it don't use it I don't trust it I don't know about you and it's not to, you know, talk bad or anything about the product, but it's just not the real thing. So I much prefer to continue using the real thing because the real thing has helped me over the years. And I know it will help you too. It also has benefits for skin, not just your hair. So it's good for the hair, it's good for the scalp, it's good for the roots of your hair, it's good to grow your hair. It's good to moisturize your hair and strengthen the strands and strengthen the follicles and to promote sheen and shine and all of that right but not only is it good for the hair it's also good for the skin it's good to hydrate the skin to moisturize the skin so it has a lot of benefits and I'm using it for those benefits so if you are serious about your hair and skin journey then this product is for you the brand is called Jumbeline and it's it comes in a two ounce and four ounce bottles so this is what it looks like see Jamaican black castor oil this is the four ounce bottle this is 
the two orange bottle get used to it look at it it's called Jumbeline so when you see this online in store you know it's from Rachelin and Sean and I also use it in Sean's hair so it's good for men it's good for women it's good for hair and skin so as long as you have hair and skin it's good for you so that's the size difference on the site when you go on you'll see we have bundles because I know if you're anything like me I like to have enough so that when one finishes I can just go on to another bottle without having to go buy again so I like to buy two or three at a time so that I have enough so when, when I'm on the second bottle I can know to start ordering and I don't ever run out like what happened to me earlier so I have bundle deals where you can get two or three at a time so check it out let me know what you guys think and when you do get your hands on your bottle I'd love for you to use it and go back to the website and leave your reviews let me know what you think about it send me your pictures let me see a before and after let me see how it has helped you we'd love to see and love to hear about your progress it's one big family and I just want to say thank you guys for your support and I'm always looking out for you guys so whatever that's going to help to benefit your life in some way shape or form as long as I can get in on it I will definitely introduce you guys to it because that's what I'm about so I'm looking forward to you guys getting a product and using it and for it to benefit you and work on your hair and your skin let me know what you guys think I'm excited. Are you excited? I'm excited. And right now, shipping. Oh, and shipping is for US, UK, and Canada. Because those are the three countries that most people tell me they're located in. If you're somewhere else, please let me know if you want it in your country and I can look into how the shipping process works for there. Remember, it's new. This is all new to me. And. We're doing it on our own, Sean and I. So it's a learning. We're learning as we go. So let me know. Let me know your thoughts and all of that. And we'll improve as we go. I know we're not going to get everything perfect all at once. But we will eventually. And I'll start somewhere. And this is a start. And I'm happy to have you guys along on the journey with us. So Jumbeline. Jumbeline. Get it. Get it. Get it in the head. Jumbeline. Anyways, I'm I continue to pull up me here. Can tell it's gonna be a long evening ahead of me. I need to wash it, deep condition it, oil it, all of that. We gotta do what we gotta do, what we gotta do. Remember launch date is Sunday, February 4th. But early access is Saturday, February 3rd. Oh and I wanna say thank you guys for those of you that bought anything from the baby registry so far. I've been getting the packages. Amazon is quite reliable so the stuff have arrived. So thank you so much. But those of you that didn't know that I have a registry, I do. And I'll have it linked below in the description bar below. So if you'd like to get something for baby Lynn, then you definitely can by clicking the link in the description bar below it will open up the amazon page with the things that i've selected you can go through add them to your cart and once you do and you get to the shipping section you just select registry address from the drop down menu of addresses that will come and it will send it directly to me so it's as simple as that because i know that some people had asked you know that they don't know what address to send it to it will automatically come up as registry address when you go to the shipping section and I'll get it so thank you in advance and baby thanks you in advance the hair is coming along <laughs> it's coming along we're getting there slowly but surely one step at a time one step at a time anyways I won't bore you with my singing I'll continue to pull up my hair and I'll check back in with you in the next video. So I'm gonna, you know, this is where I'm gonna run or walk, skip or hop. And I just want to say thank you guys for being here. Remember to comment below and let me know what you guys think about the 
rug, the new rug, the little living room transformation that we did earlier in the video. Well, let me know what you guys think. And um, I'm looking forward to your support. I'll see you in the next video. See you on Sunday. There's a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth I can take what I need to get by It doesn't matter